If you're looking for the best mountain bike shoes, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on the features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Tommaso Montagna 200 Mountain Bike Shoe with Buckle. Inexpensive purchase, the Tommaso Montagna 200 Mountain Bike Shoe is more of an all-around footwear that can be used for commuting, spinning, or even by the fans of mountain biking. Featuring synthetic leather in the upper's construction, the shoe provides unparalleled comfort for all-day riding. The ventilation is enhanced by the presence of mesh portions, and the toe box is specially strengthened to protect your toes from getting numb. The polyamide sole, as is the case with most of the best mountain bike shoes, is armored with fiberglass to keep the pedals rolling with maximum efficiency. For micro adjustments, as that of keeping your foot in place during the toughest rides, the Tommaso Montagna 200 mountain bike shoe with buckle have made use of a buckle system while the Velcro straps are there to attain a much more uniform fit. There is no issue with the cleats compatibility as this footwear is attuned with two bolt cleats of all the major brands in today's market. Moving on to the next at number 2 with 510 Freerider Pro. 510 is one of the most popular flat pedal shoe brands on the market, and for good reason. Their rubber technologies provide glue-like traction with pedals, and they are some of the best you can get for general trail riding. 510's Stealth Zone rubber has been added to the toe box, giving you extra protection in one of the main spots that debris and rocks will hit. They are a bit stiffer than some of the other flat pedal shoes, which means better power transfer but less support when hiking. The number 3 position is held by Physic Terra X5 Suede. Physic Terra X5 shoe can either come in suede or microtex material. The suede version offers riders a shoe made with natural materials instead of synthetics. The natural material is good for water resistance, stretch, and breathability. The suede also holds up better to damage that could incur from the trails. The X5s have a boa retention system and Velcro strap near the toe, giving you the best fit possible. The sole offers a good balance between pedaling efficiency and off-the-bike walkability, allowing them to be used for multiple types of riding. They have a good ventilation system on top of using the natural suede, so temperature regulation is not a problem. The Terra X5 suede shoes are some of the most comfortable mountain biking shoes you will be able to find. Next at number 4 we have Gyro Chamber Men's Cycling Shoes. The Gyro Jacket Roman 2 is a flat pedal shoe that looks a lot like a skate shoe. They are made for biking, but they are so comfortable and easy to walk in that you can wear them during other activities. They sport a top-of-the-line Vibram rubber outsole, giving them amazing grip whether you are biking or hiking through trails. The Jacket Roman 2s have a midsole made with Poron XRD, which is a soft, shock-absorbing material. It blocks about 90% of impact to your feet without sacrificing power transfer or performance. Relieving stress from your feet makes it much easier to go on long rides or to cycle through rough trails. If you are looking for a flat pedal shoe that is comfortable to ride in all day long, these are the perfect choice for you. The number 5 position is held by Tomasa Montagna 100. It is a versatile alternative to shoes with more specific designs. Therefore, it would be perfect for someone looking for a shoe that would also work for a different type of cycling, such as spinning or road cycling. The design of the Tomasa Montagna 100 prioritizes comfort, with mesh panels built in to keep your feet cool during long rides. The fiberglass sole is designed in a way that maximizes power transfer, giving the rider the best possible return for the energy they expend. The manufacturers offer a two-year warranty, giving customers another reason to believe in the quality of this shoe. The number six position is dominated by ZOL Predator. The ZOL Predator is another mountain bike shoe that has versatility as a selling point, as well as off-road cycling. These shoes are suitable for indoor cycling and offer compatibility with most clipless pedal types. Their design is sturdy but lightweight, offering protection from the elements as well as high performance. The sole is a rigid one, so riders with a preference for such a shoe structure may favor this option over others. One drawback here is the lack of choice when it comes to style. There are just two options, red and black or silver and black, and even these do not differ hugely from one another. That may be of little significance to the cycling purists among you, but it's still worth mentioning. These are more affordably priced than other shoes. 
Considering the high performance they offer, they are among the best mountain bike shoes for cyclists trying clipless pedals for the first time. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Gyroper. It's hard to find a quality pair of clipless shoes for under $100, but Gyro has managed just that with their new berm. For a very reasonable $75, you get a surprisingly good setup for everyday trail riding, a sturdy upper material that mixes breathability with protection, an adjustable fit, and a rubber outsole with substantial lugs for added grip in dirt and mud. Plus, the shoe's wide cleat pocket makes it easier for those still learning the ropes to clip in. It's certainly not a high-performance design like the Shimano MF of above, and committed riders should steer clear. But we think the berm offers a whole lot of bang for your buck. At less than half the price of the top rated Shimano or Gyro's own Vintana below, there are inevitably going to be some compromises in the berm's design. First up is power, the midsole priorities comfort over stiffness, so its relatively flexible build isn't very efficient. Second, the dual Velcro closures lack the precision and easy adjustability of a BOA or ratchet-style system. And finally, while the outsole is aggressively shaped, it isn't going to grip as well on rock or in particularly steep and rough sections of trail. To be fair, these are all expected sacrifices, and we think the berm is a truly impressive value option for beginners or those that only get out on the occasional trail day. The number 8 position is held by Ride Concepts Livewire. Ride Concepts is a relative newcomer to the mountain bike shoe world, but the company already is making a serious name for themselves. The Livewire is their entry-level trail offering, and we like its tough rubber outsole, modern looks, and approachable $100 MSRP. Further, the shoe includes higher-end touches like a synthetic upper and impact protection at the heel and ball of the foot. Tack on a moderately thick midsole, and you have a shoe that crosses over nicely between flowy trail days and bike park laps. The biggest downside to the Livewire is its weight, which is stretching into the downhill world at about 2 pounds for the pair. It's still manageable and not overly clunky for pedal-heavy days, but we prefer the lighter and nimbler feel of the Freerider and Freerider Pro above. Further, Right Concepts proprietary rubber outsole comes up short in terms of grip to 5 tenths, stealth zone compound, to be fair. So does pretty much every other design on the market. These issues move the live wire a little down our rankings, but we think Ride Concepts is definitely a brand to have on your radar going forward. Next at number 9, we have Gyro Cylinder Roman 2. Gyro Cylinder features mesh panels, sort of like running shoes, so your feet stay cool and ventilated even in super hot conditions. The outsole is made from a nylon and fiber combination, which is similar to this model's predecessor. To wrap things up, a boa dial and retention system is paired with a lower Velcro strap. These shoes are a solid option for all-around riding, whether that's XC, light trail riding, gravel, or even cyclocross. Off-the-bike grip is decent, and there are mounting areas for toe spikes. The result is a good entry-level SPD shoe for those looking to start using clipless shoes. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by 510 Freerider MTB. The 510 Freerider features Stealth Phantom, a high-friction and non-marking rubber that is used to make the sole of the shoe. The Stealth rubber shoe is durable with a fantastic grip for those times you need to get off your bike and walk. The upper material is a lightweight synthetic fabric that is also abrasion-resistant. This is one of the lightest of all of the 510 shoes available on the market. The midsole is compression-molded EVA. The M6 rubber soles are designed to give you the best pedal connection. The tread on the soles allows you to engage the pedal pins and the Freerider MTB are designed to allow for foot adjustment when riding. This is important as it makes it easier to readjust your foot when climbing and you need to pedal under the arch, or when manualing or bunny hopping and you need to have your toes all the way back on the pedal, and when cornering you can place your foot on the edge of the pedal. These are the perfect shoes for those using flat pedals. The outsole has a good tread. This is important for when you have to get off and push the bike over difficult areas where riding is not possible. The stiffness of the sole gives your foot the support it needs to get you through even the most difficult of rides. The M6 rubber offers not only stiffness but also some cushioning which dampens the vibrations and allows you to weather the big hits in comfort. The fit of the shoe is designed to support and give comfort to your foot during your ride. The soles have enough grip for when you need to push and not ride. Stiff yet flexible, this is one of the best 510 shoes for mountain biking on the market and will be sure to give you the boost you need when taking on the difficult trails. Check out the 510 Impact VX side shoes for other weather conditions. 
That's all for today. We upload outdoor product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.